we are officially into the week it's the first day of the week into sunday it's officially week of black friday sales and you guys know us we love shopping for lego deals and black friday screams the best lego deals that we will possibly see so what's up everybody my name is Christo from stud city in today's video we're going to be taking a deep dive because tonight we are going to be seeing amazon load up their second of three waves of black friday lego deals well all deals in general but specifically we're going to be focusing on black friday lego deals because we are a lego channel so if that all sounds dandy and you want to look at some other websites and other stores that are going to be making huge huge lego sales i think you're going to really enjoy today's video so i appreciate you being here and taking the time i'll try to make it nice and short and sweet as possible so let's jump straight on into it first things first i wanted to point out amazon is going to be dropping their promos their black friday lego deals starting at 3 yes 3 a.m eastern standard time now unfortunately i'm not going to be streaming this i'm not going to do a live stream for these releases but we will be going to bed here very soon and we'll be waking up extra early to keep you guys updated on these deals and we're going to be calling them out left and right on the channels so make sure to hit that subscribe button turn on notifications bells because we are going to be making the most of these lego sales and deals and i'll try to post these in the community tab but uh another platform to look out for would be on instagram on my stories as well as in the discord server so as long as that all sounds dandy hit that subscribe button turn notification bells like i said don't miss a beat there that is 3 a.m i know that's bright and early they currently have a few handful of current lego deals uh going on that are i don't know they're pretty decent i figured i'd call them out in today's video just because we are going to talk about amazon here just for a second uh but they have the lego bts uh dynamite set for 68.99 that's essentially a little bit over 30 percent off they have the lego jurassic park visitor center that one is from 130 dollars mark to 84 dollars, so a decent little price point uh one that i thought was pretty interesting if you're a completionist and want to get all the like star wars lego sets the four plus uh, ten, uh star wars tenno jedi temple is on sale um i believe that one is a little bit around the 30 percent range so in at 27.99 but anyways those are just a handful of lego sets currently on sale from the amazon group and hopefully we see a lot better sales in a little in just a little bit one other website i wanted to call out to you guys was going to be best buy they currently have some decent i would say average lego sales i'm not really going to talk about them too much in today's video but it's just another retailer I want to be aware of as Black Friday rolls around and we might see some crazy flash sales. And to go along with that one, we also have Kohl's. I think it's very worthwhile to check your in-store Kohl's. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like you're able to get some of these online sales. I don't know what's going on with their website, but they have Lego Star Wars advent calendars priced in at $9.99 clearance. And this is clearly the old uh, advent calendar as well as some of the old Lego Star Wars battle packs. Um, even Grievous' uh, Jedi Starfighter, the Yoda, just a bunch of old retired Lego sets, and they had them on their page. But um, if you click on them, they're all out of stock. I just thought it was interesting, but hey, who knows? Maybe you'll get lucky in store. So worthwhile, and definitely a, a franchise Kohl's. We're going to be talking about more here as Black Friday rolls around because they do have some decent stacks on quite a few uh, different Lego deals and sales. Uh, I think, obviously, I would say the most insane Lego sales we've seen for Black Friday so far has been Targets. They did a very awesome job getting me to swipe to swipe the card uh, pretty extensively on a, a multitude of cards just because their deals were impressive, guys. They ran deals, I believe it went all the way up to a little bit over 50% off sets that were, I would say, highly sought after. And it's not like they were just in my opinion garbage lego sets i mean i mean sets that i'm just not interested in they were sets that i was very very interested in and i think the whole discord server was very interested in. and i think you guys watching were very interested in these sets so a huge huge knock to target there for getting black friday deals um now if you ordered a black friday uh, lego sales and deals in the early october you're pretty fortunate here you can price match some of those sets um to the best sale price there was which is really really cool so all the way from october set 22nd and you can continue to do that all the way to december 24th which again is a nice thing that i think target is doing that way if you do get a set and it ends up going cheaper you can get the difference so a great way to do that um one set that i think was the fan favorite guys was the lego star wars republic fighter tanks 
We knew this one was coming uh, thanks to our good friend Life Bricks, but $24.99 for this. Um, it sold out. I went to a few targets today and it was sold out every one of those targets. Um, online, I ordered them right away. I figured they would not stay in, the store, in stock and uh, they, they sold out, right? Um, and that goes to say with a multitude of other sets as well. Um, there's a bunch of sets that just are no longer at this. They, they say the price, but they're just no longer available. Um, one that I thought was another fantastic deal was the Lego Star Wars Boba Fett Throne Room. Again, going over 50% off is uh, it's just an indicator for me to buy. And uh, I'm glad I scooped up some uh, as we see inventory start to fly off the shelves. But uh, especially on these retiring soon Lego sets, I mean, we're in uh, the tail end of November now, and we have just a month left to get these sets before they're out of production. Who knows how much stock they have, but something to keep in mind there. So anyways, that's kind of my recap on Target. Now, of course, we have uh, a bunch of Lego uh, promotions that are going to be coming as we wrap up Insider's Weekend. Uh, Insider's Weekend is going to carry on into uh, Monday, It's going to, which is essentially double Insider points on any Lego purchase. Um, and we still have like the 3x and the 4x points on a multitude of sets. However, the promotional items uh, seemed to, I believe the one sold out. I can confirm that here just a second. Oh, I guess it didn't sold out. It's still available. Well, you can still get Majesto's Magical Workshop as well as the Winter Market Stole. The one that sold out was the Christmas mug for spending $65 on like Ninjago or Lego City or Lego Friends or Lego Duplo. I think Creator was on there. But that one seemed to have sold out, unfortunately. So there's no longer a triple promo stack, but you can still get the double promo stack of Majesto's Magical Workshop and the Winter Market Stall. Now, this is ending, clearly it says, on the 19th. So here at the end of tonight at midnight, these will no longer be on the Lego website. Good news for you is we are going to see these be restocked here for Black Friday. And of course, we'll be talking more about that here as the week goes on. So make sure, like I said, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss videos and updates on stacking the best deals. I know you guys are excited for this. And I want to just tell you right now, we will be going live for Black Friday. I know. I know. I wouldn't miss it for the world. And for you guys, uh, it was a close second. But <laughs> you know I wouldn't miss that stream. I'm super, super pumped, and we will also be doing a live drop. Georgiana's going to be working extremely hard to pull off something pretty nice and unique for that stream, but uh, I know the swipe the cards. I appreciate you guys for loading up on these. I think, again, I think we have a couple left. I think there's two more smalls left or something like that. Um, if you want to get one, make sure to check out the website, and on Black Friday, we will be doing a new release and taking the sweatshirts or the crewnecks off the website, so those will be officially retired, and we'll be doing a new release, which I'm really excited for, so if that all sounds dandy, I'll see you guys there. I'll set the stream up here pretty early in the week, as uh, we have a lot to talk about, ladies and gentlemen, but let me know what you guys think of these LEGO sales and deals. Did it get you? Uh, were they good enough sales? Did they get you? Did you swipe the card? I want to hear all of it. Let me know all your Lego purchases. I'll give you a little bit of hint. I'm going to do a huge haul video, of course, for you guys. But uh, we made a huge order at Target. I think we spend, um, I don't know. I have no idea right now. We will cover that in a haul video very soon. Uh, but I know I spent 500 or five, six, 700 somewhere in that price range the other night on just Republic Fighter Tanks, the Boba Fett Throne Room, and uh, I don't know, miscellaneous Star Wars sets. I think Target deals because honestly, I could not pass those up. But as more deals roll around, we will be buying more. We're getting skin in the game and uh, we're happy doing it. And of course, we need that lego.com order to get all our holiday plushies. So we'll be ordering another plushie here on the Midnight Live stream for Black Friday. But as always, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below. Hope you have an amazing week. Happy Sunday. It kicks off the new week, and uh, it's going to be one of the craziest weeks, um, I would say, of our channel in, in all of the year. So cheers to ending off the year and uh, getting in things into good shape. Anyways, guys, see you in the next one. My name is Christopher from Stud City. Peace out.